Hey, hey, YouTube. Um, I'm playing with my cards today. I hadn't done it in ooh, way too long, maybe over a year. These are my medicine cards. And it's past due time for me to shuffle the cards and see how I'm doing. Be it negative or positive. I used to do it quite often, but you know, you just forget. I'm remembering, uh, shoot, a lot of things now, but I'm not too good at shuffling these cards because my, what you get, uh, <laughs> with the right in your fingers and wrists and stuff, and you just can't do it like you used to. Okay, I'll cut them and you can't see me cutting them, but I'm cutting them. Let's pull one. I think I want to pull from the middle. Let's see. Mm. This is the one I pull upright the mouse. 20. Let's see what the book says about Mr. Mouse. Let's go to this book. He's on page 20. Let's see what the mouse is saying. What does he say to me? I pulled him upright and go to page 20 where are you mouse mm -hmm. okay mm. that's a picture of the mouse and i read the poem it says mouse if i could see the world through your tiny eyes maybe then i would know how to scrutinize Every detail carries weight and true to its purpose, has its perfect puzzle place to stop the T, the three ring circles. Hmm. Okay, it says, Mouse says, I will touch everything with my whiskers in order to know it. Paradoxically, this is both a great power and a weakness. It is good medicine to see up close. It is good medicine to pay attention to detail, but it is bad medicine to chew everything into pieces. Mouse has many predatory enemies, including birds, snakes, and cats. Since mouse is food for many, it has a mighty developed sense of danger at every turn. So-called civil civilization is a highly complex set of components which calls for more and more organizational skills and scrutiny to details every year. Mouse is a powerful medicine to have in these modern times. Things that might appear insignificant to others take an erroneous importance to mouse. Mouse people anger many other medicine types because they appear to be nitpickers. Hmm, nitpickers. <laughs> oh, most mouse people will spoil the lint on your will spot the lint on your coat, even if it matches in color. They will try to convince you that the simplest task is fraught with difficulty. Difficulty. They are fixated on methodology. They sort and categorize and file away for later use. They may seem like they are hoarding, but this is the farthest thing from Mouse's mind. They are merely putting everything in order so they may be able to explore it more carefully at a later date. Hmm. Okay, now it says... If your personal mouse is medicine is mouth, you may be fearful of life, but very well organized with a compartment for everything. You should try to see a larger picture than the one staring at you in the face. Develop largest largeness of spirit. Try to become aware of the great dance of life. Realize that even though you may be sitting in Los Angeles, there's also a New York, a moon, a solar system, and a galaxy, and an infant universe. Jump high, little friend. You will glimpse the sacred mountain. 
If mouse is in your card spread, its medicine is telling you to scrutinize. Hmm. Look at yourself and others carefully. Maybe that big hunk of cheese is sitting on a trigger that will spring a deadly trap. Maybe the cat is in the pantry waiting for you. Maybe someone to whom you have de delegated authority, such as a doctor, a lawyer, or even a plumber, is not doing the job faithfully. The message is to see what is right before your eyes and to take action accordingly. Ooh. Oh, I should have been did this because... <laughs> oh, we In the past, I say two years, people have been dropping like flies in my life. I mean, it's, it's like... I, I've been very critical with them, and I've been analyzing their thoughts. It, this is mostly kin people, but man, it's like, okay, they say some things, and it'd be a little mm, out of order, and instead of me weighing out what they've been doing for a long time, they have a message for me, and they don't know how to tell me, and I... I help you to, I mean, I've been, I've understanding that you want me to leave you alone. And that's what I've learned, I've been learning to do. I have deleted a block so many people, people I've known for over 15 and 20 years and just block them out of my life, out of my YouTube. It's like, whoa, Mary. But if they wasn't no, not serving me and, so I did that. And I'm still on that hunt. I'm being that mouse and being careful. My whiskers and, and my intuition is king. And I'm so okay with it. I am at a good place in my life when it comes to people who have put they have put me in a place and made me wake up to see things as they really are, how they really feel about me. It hurts, but you gotta get over it. These people, people I've known nearly all my life, all of their life too. <laughs> so, Miss Mary, you just ooh, put on your armor and be strong. But anyway, we coming up on seven, eight minutes, so that's enough. But the cards are good. If you can think of these cards are old. I've had these cards. This is the box. I've had these cards for over 30 years. And they they have really been on point for me. And a lot of people will come and pull the cards. And they say, oh my God, how did they know I was going through that? This is a good deck. It's called Medicine Cards. This is how they look. If you decide to get them, I don't know how much you could probably get it on Amazon. But anyway, this is my my uh, reading for myself, the mouse. Anyway, I'm gone, guys. Y'all have a good one. Bye.